His face bruised and his legs shackled, 40-year-old Vince Lee made his first appearance in court to face charges that he stabbed and then beheaded his seatmate. It happened aboard this Greyhound bus traveling from Edmonton, Alberta to Winnipeg, Manitoba Wednesday night. Lee was charged with second-degree murder, an indication prosecutors don't believe the attack was premeditated. Right now we're just asking for a, a, that a psychological assessment be done so that uh, we can determine whether he's fit to stand trial or uh, um, if he's suffering from any mental disorders or anything like that. Authorities say Lee has no known criminal record and worked as a carrier for several newspapers in Edmonton, Alberta. One of his employers says he delivered papers until last Monday and then fell off the face of the earth. Police haven't provided details on the attack, nor have they identified the victim. But friends of the man who was decapitated say he was 22-year-old Tim McLean, a small, easygoing carnival worker they say would never go looking for a fight. The hardest part was trying to explain to my kids that they never see Uncle Tim again. He was like a brother. He was always there for everyone. A witness who was sitting one seat in front of the two men said he didn't hear the two speak to each other before the attack. And he said the suspect wasn't sitting near the victim initially and had only been riding on the bus for about an hour. But he said Lee changed seats following a rest stop. Ross Simpson, The Associated Press.